Somewhere I have a tier six Soviet battleship captain, and he will do fine for, for these purposes. Ismail, yes. Come here. There we go. Perfectly fine. Well, the Italian is better because she's, she's a tier lower than she should be, right? Remember, Cesare, they attempted to make Cesare a tier a tier six battleship, and the community lost its collective minds. No, you can't nerf my premium ship. Okay, then we can never sell it again. There you go. Those are your options. Hmm, I don't think... Her secondaries aren't amazing. I don't remember the secondaries being very good. No, they really aren't. Let's do aiming. Let's let's try to make her more accurate. Uh, probably want to flood. Uh, yeah, flood and fire. What are you doing? Get your butt in here. There we go. Do that, and then do some of this. Let's go do flags. You think so, Abyss? I've never felt like. I mean. Black can do the same little smoke hydro trick that Belfast can. I'm sorry, smoke radar trick that Belfast can. But she's far more limited. And they just nerfed the ship. I, you know, I don't... I like Black. Black is a Fletcher. I will always like the ship. But I've never felt like she was this grossly OP, ridiculous thing, right? Do people still complain about her? Is, her, is things A worth anything? Doesn't look like it. They kept the long range, the long range guns. It looks like, and upgraded the mid range aura. It's not worth it. Secondaries. At least they, at least they pin, at least they pin uh, destroyers. All right, why not? Yeah, it's a Cesare. It's a Cesare. It's a Giulio Cesare. Oh, hang on, missing a flag. Well, she will never more. It hasn't gone in yet. But it's only two seconds. And I still... Exactly. I mean, Chaser's got a point. Black is not that common a ship, right? Even today, Black is not that common a ship. So, I mean, yeah, they're nerfing it. But again, it's like the ship is not that, you know, all that in a bag of chips. There she is. I love this camo. The solid blue. What are my options? Like a blue and like a light, like a light blue? Oh, that's pretty. Man, those are pretty. Look at that. Look at that, man. That ship is that ship is gorgeous. Look at that. Love it. All right, let's try this thing out. Um, now, did they... It does. It does indeed, Zach. Now, I question, did they... Is Black on the naughty list? They yanked her out of the store for steel, right? She was available, and then she's been gone for a while, right? Is that correct? I feel like that's correct. All right, we're middle tier. This is fine. No carrier. Lots of squishy cruisers to shoot at. I'm okay with this plan. Oh, Charbs. Stop it. I'm blushing. Okay. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> what do I think about Grimmy? I think Grimmy is a, Grimmy is a collector's item. Grammy used to be obscene. Grammy hasn't been obscene for a long time. Um, she's a collector's item. She's the, the the auction is a boat collector's thing, right? Like if you want to collect one, go get one. But don't fool yourself into thinking she's some kind of OP monster. She's not. Those days are those days are behind her. Let's go surfing now. Everybody's learning how. Come on. I hadn't heard that, Abyss. If so, I'm okay with that though. Stay alive. Black yeah. should come back. I like Black. I want her to be more available. I want, I want more people to have access to the ship. But they obviously feel like they've got to make some tweaks. All right, make some tweaks. I mean, it's a ship that has one really strong cap control gimmick in a world where there are lots of ships in her matchmaking bracket that have lots of strong cap control gimmicks. I'm looking at you, Ragnar. Okay, so like the idea that Black is some OP ridiculous monster is silly. She's not. She never was. She's strong, sure. Is she stronger than Smalland? Arguable. I'm going to say no, honestly. I think Smalland is better. Of course, Smalland is also on the naughty list as well. You see my point, though, Knox. My point is, they're they're trying to make me. They're trying to make you believe that that Black is Black needs balancing when they've released other ships at tier ten in her matchmaking bracket that are even more imbalanced. So. The idea that you need to nerf black before you re-release it, to me, is silly. If they're going to nerf her, if they make some minor nerfs to the ship, fine. Right? Whatever. I, I'm going to keep playing mine. I lo I've loved that. I've wanted that ship ever since she was announced. I've loved her the day, ever since the day I got her. 
but like it's you know the notion that she's just you know some massively OP monster is just silly right Edge and maybe that's the thing maybe they felt like they needed to nerf the duration and then release her fine if that's what you think do it man are you stopping You know, Chaser, the, the ship that I continually keep coming back to and thinking they should just re-release this ship is Kutuzov. And every time I open my big mouth and think and say, man, Kutuzov is fine. They should just re-release this ship like she is. I go out and I have a monster game in her. Like, it's just ridiculous. Ooh, he backed right into my salvo. Come on. Mmm. Should have smoked, my dude. Should have smoked. Why are you sitting in the open <laughs> where we can spot you? <laughs> Come on, my dude. Oh, that Kearney just got slapped. Let's add to the slappage, shall we? Gotta wait for him to finish. I'm gonna wait for him to finish maneuvering. Looks like he's trying to turn in. Looks like he's trying to turn in. That ought to get him dead if I led those right. And deleted. Now you see me. Who's now Striker on the other team and a Friedrich. Look at look at you go. Oh, good. Our Mahan ate a face full of torpedoes. So our destroyers are basically not very good. That's what I'm taking away so far, is that our destroyers are just bad. Because one of them's dead, the other one's mostly dead, and neither one of them in a position to do anything about board control. They're just bad. Okay. Go away, Fos Go away Fuso, I'm busy. Man, those shells took a long time to get there. Piss off, Striker. Hang on. I've got a Pan-Asian cruiser to delete. Go away, striker. God, you're irritating. Won't you just go away? Leave me alone. <laughs> I love how you're like, here, take 10k. I'm like, here, bounce them off the top of your turrets for no damage. <laughs> oh my god, this team again. Terrible. Terrible. <laughs> I'm so glad these guys brought Pan-Asian Cruisers into this game. Oh, it's been glorious so far. I'm loving it. Even though I have the only two kills on my team, because apparently my team has no idea what they're doing.
Did our Mutsuki finally die? Looks like he did. Yeah, finally bought it. Having accomplished exactly nothing. Outstanding. Well done, Mutsuki. Well done. Indrakt is so cute. He's like, if I sit here bow on to the battleship, I can't get hurt. Okay. Let me introduce you. Let me show you how wrong you are. Oh, the kamikaze's coming in, is he? All right, bring it, my son. Desert road, no gas, and no chicks. Did he really get that lucky? He had no idea which way I was going to turn. Look at this dude. Look at the luck. This is going to fuck up my hair. Ah, <sighs> uh, much better. I'm having fun slapping cruisers, but since the rest of my team doesn't know how to lead the spawn, then uh, yeah, that's a loss. So, um, I like the guns. Guns very good at slapping cruisers. Ship, honestly, not that bad. Um, if you have one, yeah, I, honestly, I like that better than Ismail. I don't care for Ismail. Mo I mean, Ismail is a typical tier, mid-tier battleship, which means, uh, right, like just not interested, not worth, not worth my time. But that's a ship I could see myself playing. Again, it's a derivative of Cesare, which is already one of the best mid-tier battleships you can own. So I like her. I like her. I like the ship. That's nice. I still you still gotta have a competent team, right? Like, which I haven't had for most of the evening. Hmm. She's Italian, PJ. The lines on all the Italian ships are gorgeous. Nature of the beast. I mean, in a game that I live less than 10 minutes on a flank that basically everybody on my team, like, melted and accomplished nothing, I still did 90,000 damage. I'm pretty happy with that. It would be nice if I could get a competent team once this evening, though. Like, that would be nice. I don't even, I don't even, I don't even care if I win. I just want to have, like, a, 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 like a decent game. I haven't had one of those. Doesn't feel like it. I know, Gabe. I'll have to go look, but, like, it doesn't feel like... Let's see, what did we play tonight? Um, the Cossack game was actually not bad. And then is it, has it just all been downhill from there, I think? <laughs> I think it's all been downhill from there. Oh man, this this Shumpan does not know how to aim. He's dead anyway. Like their destroyers have six kills, and my destroyers were basically not present in the game. Kind of kind of tells you how this how the how the game went. <laughs> Feels bad. But hey, I got to slap around cruisers, so never, never a bad time when you get to slap around cruisers. <laughs> Another one of these this result screen physically hurts my soul moments. So I want you guys to notice something. For starters, they only had 11 players. They had 11 players to R12, 
and wiped the floor with us like we weren't even in the game. Nine of the 12 players on my team couldn't break 500 XP. I think that's a new personal record. I gotta start keeping tabs on this thing, this sort of thing. The other day I had a loss. This was a tier 10 loss that seven of the 12 players couldn't crack 500 XP. And I remember thinking, what the hell? This is nine of 12. Can't even crack 500 XP. So earlier we had that good team win. And then now I've just, I've been handed just like a, a string, an endless seeming string of just train wreck losses. Super fun.